everyone, I'm Jessica Dalcord from CNET here at CES 2014. What I have in my hands is a demo of touchless gesturing using ultrasound. This is from Elliptic Labs. It was launched at SeaTech in Japan. And this is the first time we're seeing it here at CES. What's interesting and cool about this technology is that it's using regular microphones and ultrasound speakers to create a wider field of motion. So that means that you can gesture with your hand uh, above, below, anything that you want. Another advantage is that it is going to be using low energy, so when you turn gestures on, it should not sap your battery as quickly. The advantage to ordinary users on their smartphones and tablets with this kind of technology is that you'll be able to have a lot more control over gestures. So, for example, your gesture doesn't have to be quite so precise, it can be a little bit sloppier, it can also be a little bit more complex. For example, you can twirl your fingers and that might turn up the volume on your music or you might spin your hand to do something else on your device. Now, Elliptic Labs isn't making phones and tablets themselves. They are selling this to other device makers. So what we're seeing now in this prototype is going to be a little bit different than what we see on the actual end product. A lot of that has to do with what those smartphone and tablet makers want. We're going to start seeing this next generation touchless control technology in devices very soon, in fact, in 2014. I'm Jessica Dalcourt for CNET here at CES. You can catch all of our coverage at CNET.com.